Hey, what's going on guys? And welcome to another episode of photography trips, I guess. Uh, today's video is going to be mainly focused on macro photography, insects, flowers, all kinds of insects, bees, uh, ants, elephants, cats, I don't know, whatever we find. So stay tuned. There was a lot of bees right here in this area, but as soon as we set up our stuff, they just disappeared. I can't see any right now, so I'm not sure if, if that's our bad luck or they... So as soon as I came here, this tree right here, and I'll show you in a bit, really grabbed my attention with its beautiful white flowers. I mean, it just looks magnificent. There's a lot of bees on it right now. So that's a plus. And my dad right now is trying to look for them. So I'm trying right now to show you the bee that my dad is taking a picture of but it's not as easy as I thought. So with macro photography, it's always a hit or miss. I mean, it really depends on the insect, if it's cooperating or not. Uh, most of them don't, I can tell you that. And I've really learned that with macro photography and so many things in life, patience is key. So, so far we've gotten some really good uh, close-up shots of bees. But bees are not the only kind of insects we're trying to photograph. So I hear birds chirping but I don't see any of them. I mean we came here to do macro photography but we could use some bird shots.
sweating right now. Never thought I would sweat from photographing and filming, but here we are. This is not my first time doing uh, macro photography. I'm just now more sure that insects are not cooperative at all, um, especially spiders. So we have been. Oh my god, a fly just went into my nose. we've taken pictures of bees, ants, flowers, um, we saw a couple of spiders, but with spiders they don't stand still at all, they're just all over the place and uh, I guess they're not photogenic. So, although I have said earlier in this video that we have filmed ants and took photos of them, we did not include any footage of that or pictures on purpose. Because what we thought was a video of ants just walking on the stem of a flower turned out to be something completely different. So because of that, and because of how much interesting the subject is, we decided to make a separate documentary video of what we saw. So we hope you're excited as much as we are. Now back to the video. Yeah, I just checked on my dad. He's still filming the ants that he found. I'll show you right now. I'm not sure if you'll be able to see what's going on, but he's filming ants right here. Alrighty, we're done here. I think we took some really good shots. I mean, actually my dad did all the work um, and took all the still shots. I sort of just documented what happened and videotaped it. 
We still have the editing process and uh, we're gonna see what kind of pictures we took. If you guys enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and click the subscribe button. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.